And welcome to this special edition of Inside the Huddle. I'm Becky Brune, filling in for Matt Berry. And to my right is Dallas Cowboys wide receiver, Laurent Robinson. Laurent, how are you? I'm good. How are you guys doing? I'm good. Happy holidays. Oh, you too? You too? Yeah, so what a win against Tampa that we had this past Saturday. Oh, yeah, that was a big win for us. You know, we had uh, fighting back after those two losses. We needed that bounce back win uh, to get on the roll in December. Yes, definitely. Now, Tell me a little bit about, now you're tied up with Dez right now on touchdowns. Do you think you'll one-up him this week coming up with Philly? Uh, yeah, we talked about it on the sideline. Me and Dez had a little conversation, had a little friendly bet going on that uh, I'm going to get more touchdowns of him. So tune in the last two games. I know. I, well, I, I know I'm speaking for all the fans right now. I hope we get an early Christmas present. Oh, yeah. yeah. Yes, with <laughs> Philly for sure. Now, um, a little bit, uh, tell us about your guest that you have coming on. Uh, I have Tony Fiametta, the fullback that's paving the way for DeMarco Murray, who just hurt his ankle, and uh, Felix Jones. I mean, when he's in the lineup, big things happen in the running game. Fabulous. Good deal. Well, um, I guess that's it. We'll um, be right back here on Inside the Huddle. Welcome to Inside the Huddle. Inside the Huddle is shot live on location at the House of Blues every Monday night. And welcome to this special edition of Inside the Huddle. My name is Becky Brune, filling in for Matt Berry. And to my left of me is Dallas Cowboys wide receiver, Laurent Robinson. Now, what a game we had against the Buccaneers this past Saturday. We oh yeah, that. That, that was a, that was a big win for us. You know, we uh, we came out there, we came with a lot of firepower, and early on, first half, we got a big lead, and we were able to sustain it and come out with a victory. That sounds good. Well, um, now again, you know, with Christmas, you know, almost here. Have you done any holiday shopping? Actually, no. I have not even been to the mall yet. Oh. I'm still hesitant. You know, I got a couple of days left, so I uh, I'll try to make something happen this week. Good deal. Good deal. Well, if you haven't. Um, had time or are finding that are needing to find that last minute gift. Um, Albertsons has come out with their exclusive calendar um, called The Boys and Their Pets. It's available at all local Albertsons location, only $14.99. And um, of course, it has notable players such as Jason Winton, DeMarco Murray, Miles Austin. Um, and I know, Laurent, you're going to be on next year's edition, I hear. Uh, <laughs> I might be. With you and yeah, your I was, I was a little upset they didn't have me on this year's version. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, next year I'm going to probably have my, my little dogs Polo and Coco on there. So y'all make sure to get one of those next year. Definitely, definitely. Well, um, again, and with these calendars, $2, we'll go to the Salvation Army um, per calendar that um, is sold. And um, that will be donated to all the local Sal Salvation Army centers. Um, and I know, of course, you being a cowboy and the Dallas Cowboys do a lot. Um, with the Salvation Army this time of year. Uh, what have you done this year um, as far as charitable things uh, with getting ready for the holidays? Oh, you know, I always try to give a hand back. You know, any way I can help out to give back. I've been um, trying to give donations. You know, Jesse Holly has a foundation, uh, Feed a Family Foundation. You know, I'm always supportive of that. I mean, he's doing a great job doing that. And uh, any way I can give back. So whoever has anything that they need me to do, just holler at me and I'm ready to do it. Well, this segment is brought to you by CC Carpet Albertsons. Under Armour, IPMS, Social Meds, and Pepsi. Inside the Huddle will be right back here on FSN. This segment of Inside the Huddle was brought to you by Westway Ford, CC Carpet, and Albertsons. It means a great deal. And we have a big sell. Check this out. You're going to be excited. Wait. Oh, ho, ho. On everything, everything zero percent. No, Jack, no. Zero percent on select models. There you go. Wait. Get zero percent on every pre owned and zero percent on select new Fords at WestwayFord.com. Just two minutes east of George Bush on 183 at Irving, Las Colinas. Here's the game plan save a little cash and show your cowboy spirit. Save 10 percent on groceries at Albertsons every Cowboys game day when you wear your favorite jersey. Hey, 10% off all your game day favorites. And I know just the jersey to wear. Well, that's a great one. Hi, I'm Steve from CC Carpet. We had another Grand Slam by introducing our best price match guarantee. 
That's right, Dad. But let's give everyone even more great deals. We have the best prices every day, the best service every day, and the best way to pay for it with 0% interest for 18 months. Now through the end of January, CC Carpet has the best price match guarantee. If you get a better deal on the same product installed, we'll give you the difference back, but only at CC Carpet. CC Carpet, discount centers. Foot and heel pain can be debilitating. From the moment you wake up, it can feel like you're walking on a bed of nails. If you've experienced burning, numbness, or tingling in your foot, it could be an entrapped nerve. At the Microsurgery Institute of Dallas, we specialize in one of the most advanced nerve decompression procedures available. So you can do the things you like to do and start to walk away from foot pain for good. Call or log on to Microsurgery Institute of Dallas and start to walk away from foot pain today. Book your perfect getaway now. Why wait until the last minute to save? Lock in the best pricing right now for the vacation of your choice with Apple Vacations. Turn fantasies into realities in Mexico, including air, hotel, all meals and drinks. For the right advice and best price, ask an agent. Hurry, best dates and hotels are going fast. Get it louder. Coming closer. Footsteps don't lie. So the question is, do you hear footsteps? Or are they hearing yours? This segment of Inside the Huddle was brought to you by Under Armour. Protect this house with Under Armour. Innovative Plumbing Mechanical Services and Social Meds. And welcome back to this special holiday edition of Inside the Huddle presented by Westway Ford. I'm, um, I'm Becky Brune filling in for Matt Berry and Laurent Robinson is here with us and special guest Tony Fiametta. How are you? Great. How are you guys? I'm doing good. Doing Thanks good. Thanks for having me out. Well, um, you know, most of the players have been saying these last three games are a must win for us um, to make it to the playoffs. Now, we've got one down, two to go. How are you feeling about Philly next week? I'm feeling great about it. Obviously, you know, it didn't turn out the way we wanted to the first time. But, uh, you know, we learned from the mistakes that we made. And uh, we're definitely going to get out there and uh, do our best and get a win. Um, Tony, is there anything that you do on your off time? around this holiday season giving back and well, with the with the team we went out to uh the children's hospitals around the around the area and i happened to go out to um, arlington and uh that was uh one, one of the you know kind of heartwarming things that we do get get with the kids that uh really need need some help and need someone to come in there and make them feel good and you know it's it's uh, i'll definitely go out of my way anytime for those kids definitely that is fabulous laurent yeah, I was involved with that. I didn't go to the same place as him. We went to, um, we went, actually went to Fort Worth, Cook Hospital in Fort Worth, and uh, we had a good time, you know, just just a humbling experience, you know, just being able to give back to the kids, you know, just give them a, a, take a picture with them, make them smile, and make it change their, change their whole day around. It was a good, good time. Definitely. And speaking of kids, now, Tony, you have a newborn, a pretty little girl, don't you? Yeah, pretty little girl. She's seven months old now. She's, uh, her name is Aubrey. Um, believe it or not, she's got red hair and blue eyes. I don't know where that came from. Maybe the mom's side. I was a little surprised when I saw that. But, uh, yeah, she's a beautiful girl, and it's a great experience raising her and my son, Vincent, who's three. Well, then, I guess um, that's about it. We're going to go here to the Microsurgery Institute report up next. This segment of Inside the Huddle was brought to you by Westway Ford, Home Marketing Services. HMS is your one-stop shop for all of your real estate and mortgage needs. And IHOP. And we're back here with our Microsurgery Institute Injury Report. Now, Laurent, your shoulder, um, they didn't know if you were going to play um, against Tampa. So that was a game day decision that you were actually going to go in. How is it feeling? Uh, it's feeling good. You know, I've been uh, working hard with the trainers, trying to do everything I can do off the field to make sure I'm on the field on game day. And 
we made it happen. Okay, good deal. Now, so whenever you actually get hurt or another player gets hurt during a game, what is, um, you know, we see on the television, you know, you get knocked down, trainers come out there. What actually goes on behind the scenes? Do they take you back there? Do you, they get you x-rayed right then? Uh, yeah, pretty much they just take you back in the back room. They want to check you out, take your pads off. You have an upper body um, injury, take your pads off, get an x-ray, or do whatever they need to do, any additional tests that they can't do on the sideline, and go from there. Thank Decide you. if you need to go back in or not. Good deal. Well, this is our Microsurgery Institute Injury Report. Day for Dallas Cowboys cornerback Allen Ball. Running back to Shard Choice and cornerback Orlando Skandrick requires strength, preparation, vision, and focus. But it no longer requires contact lenses. At least not anymore. Thanks to eye LASIK by Dr. Harvey Carter, official eye surgeon of your Dallas Cowboys. Call to be a part of the Carter Cowboys LASIK celebration. Thank you, Dr. Carter. Something in the pocket. Banana. Side pocket. Apple. Pocket. Strawberries. Fruit pocket pancakes at IHOP. Our famous buttermilk pancakes bursting with the fruit fillings you love starting at $3.99. IHOP. Come hungry, leave happy. People talk about how hard it is to get a house and all the trouble you have to go through. You don't have to go through all that trouble if you're talking with the right people. People always say it's who you know. Well, HMS is the people you need to talk to, and that's who you need to know because they've taken care of us. We called, we came in for the evaluation that same day. They were like, you qualify for this much, you can get a house. And we were calling everybody. We knew at that point, like, we're going to get a house. Get out of the rent race, call HMS. Touchdown, Cowboys. Yeah. We'll be right back. Oh. This season, the Papa John's Cowboys Unlimited Combo is back. And at $10.99 for a large Papa John's pizza with unlimited toppings and a Pepsi 2 liter, it's a dream. With the Cowboys Unlimited Combo, you can get your Papa John's pizza however you want it. It's the perfect combination of hot, fresh Papa John's pizza, ice cold Pepsi, and Dallas Cowboys football. Order yours online for just $10.99. Better ingredients, better pizza, Papa John's. This segment of Inside the Huddle was brought to you by Papa John's. Better ingredients, better pizza. Heradura Tequila. And Lifestyle Technologies, your solution for integrated electronics in the home and office. And welcome back to this special edition of Inside the Huddle, presented by Westway Ford. Um, just so you know, we do tape this show live every Monday night at the House of Blues. And to ring in the 2012 um, House of Blues style, enjoy a delicious four-course meal and live entertainment um, from the Voodoo Sage as Crossroads at House of Blues celebrates the new year. Uh, make your reservations today by calling 214-978-4850 or visit www.houseofblues.com backslash Dallas for more information. Uh, this segment is presented by Lifestyle Technologies, Heradura Tequila 7-Eleven, Pepsi's and Apple Vacation. So now we're going to turn the tables a little bit. Um, Laurent, are you good to interview Tony? Uh, yeah, interviewing, that's kind of like something, that's what I do. Yeah. <laughs> well, there it's we easy. go. Yeah. I'm going to pass the ball off to you. All right. How y'all doing? <laughs> Tony, what's up, man? What's going on? Nothing. Just uh, how did you, what, what was your role? What was your path? How did you get to be a Dallas Cowboy? Let us, let us fill us in. Well, uh, first, obviously, it started um, with the dream of playing in the NFL, which started in college. I knew that I had an opportunity to, to uh, fulfill that dream later on in my career in Syracuse. And, uh, you know, I ended up getting drafted to the Carolina Panthers in the fourth round. I was there for two years and ended up getting uh, cut from the, from the Panthers this August. And, uh, you know, when that, when that happened, you know, a lot of things were going through my mind. I didn't really know what was going to happen in my career, but luckily I got a, you know, got a call from the Cowboys, got to uh, meet up with Coach Garrett and the organization, and uh, I know they've been needing a fullback for a while, so I was glad to come here, and I know they really love to run the ball, so it's a great place for me. Very, very interesting, because um, just uh, when I came to Dallas, in order for me to come on a team, they had to cut him. Remember that? Yeah. At the beginning of the season? Yeah. So they cut him and brought me on. And then the second week of the season, they cut me and brought him back. Yeah. <laughs> so it was a little, little crazy. So uh, and now we're just we're glad to be playing on the same team, uh, both contributing and doing a good job. So um, going going through a play, just 
just fill the crowd in, the fans in. Like, what goes through your mind when you, if you have like a 42 lead ISO? You have to go one on one with the linebacker. Tell us what your thought process is. Well, uh, I think first of all, I, you got to study the person that you're going to go against. You kind of got to know what kind of guy he is. You got to know if he's going to run around you or if he's going to just try and take your head off. And, you know, really, w once you know that, you know how you're going to approach it. And uh, you got to know the technique and everything. But those guys are really trying to uh, take your lunch money and, and try and prove what kind of man they are. You really just got to go and hit them as hard as you can. Almost close your eyes and hope for the best. <laughs> I was going to ask you if you close your eyes. Yeah, okay. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man, that's funny. That's funny. So, um, okay, and you're, uh, like after you get off from practice and stuff, when you go home, what do you do in your free time? Uh, I just hang out with my family. Like, uh, like we were talking about before, I got a three-year-old three boy and, uh, and a seven-month-old uh, daughter. So, you know, they take up a lot of my time, uh, obviously around Christmas and doing all those things I need to do for them and making sure they got all the traditions going is important. So, uh, yeah, just hanging out with my family, hanging out with my beautiful wife, Alicia, and it, it's just a great time. All right. That's, that's good, man. That's good. Family man, right? Yeah, definitely. Like all the way. That's all I'm about. I did notice you earlier. You were talking to one of the guys that worked at it was the owner of GameStop. You uh, you get into video games at all or anything? Or you know what? I'm not I'm not a a, a game kind of guy. But uh, he's actually in the Marine Corps, and my brother and dad were in the Marine Corps. Are in the Marine Corps, and um, you know, just to talk to those guys and kind of you know see what they're see what they're all about. It's a great experience. Well, um, again, this segment is brought to you by Lifestyle Technologies, Herdura Tequila, 7-Eleven, and Apple Vacations. We will be right back whenever we turn the tables, and Tony will interview Laurent on this edition of Inside the Huddle here on FSN. This segment of Inside the Huddle was brought to you by Westway Ford, Apple Vacations, Dymaco, Pepsi Max, the official soft drink of the Dallas Cowboys, and your local 7-Eleven store. Keith, you know when you've made it? No. You've made it. Once you get your own action figure. Check this out. What do you think? Impressive? Where's your action figure? That's not an action figure. Sure it is. No, that's a bobblehead. And anyone can have a bobblehead. Anyone doesn't have one now. Drive up to 790 miles on a single tank and get 7,000 in rebates on any F-Series truck at WestwayFord.com. Two minutes east of George Bush on 183 at Irving, Las Colinas. You know my Jason, when he really wants something bad enough, there's no point in trying to stop him. So when he wants a great steak, I go straight to Albertsons because I know that they only sell the best USDA choice beef. Always tender, always full of flavor. That's what Jason wants every time. And believe me, you wouldn't want to get in his way. Now that's choice. And it's only choice beef at Albertsons. Albertsons, it means a great deal. Hi, I'm Steve from CC Carpet. We had another Grand Slam by introducing our best price match guarantee. That's right, Dad, but let's give everyone even more great deals. We have the best prices every day, the best service every day, and the best way to pay for it with 0% interest for 18 months. Now through the end of January, CC Carpet has the best price match guarantee. If you get a better deal on the same product installed, we'll give you the difference back, but only at CC Carpet. CC Carpet, discount centers. Foot and heel pain can be debilitating. From the moment you wake up, it can feel like you're walking on a bed of nails. If you've experienced burning, numbness, or tingling in your foot, it could be an entrapped nerve. At the Microsurgery Institute of Dallas, we specialize in one of the most advanced nerve decompression procedures available. So you can do the things you like to do and start to walk away from foot pain for good. Call or log on to Microsurgery Institute of Dallas and start to walk away from foot pain today. Book your perfect getaway now. Why wait until the last minute to save? Lock in the best pricing right now for the vacation of your choice with Apple Vacations. Turn fantasies into realities in Mexico, including air, hotel, all meals and drinks. For the right advice and best price, ask an agent. Hurry, best dates and hotels are going fast. Fast. 
last thing. Get it louder. Coming closer. Footsteps don't lie. So the question is, do you hear footsteps? This segment of Inside the Huddle was brought to you by Gillespie Jewelers, Champion Limousines, and Replicopy. And welcome back to FSN. This is Inside the Huddle with Becky Brune, Tony, Tony Fiametta, and Laurent Robinson. Um, this segment is brought to you by Dymaco, Gillespie Jewelers, Champion Limousine, and a Beer Star Hotel and Resort. Um, so I guess with the holidays, of course, coming up, I know we've chatted a little bit about things that you've done in the community and stuff like that. Um, so what is your, the best present that you've ever received in your entire life as a kid, as an adult? What was the best present you ever received and what was the worst present you ever received? Go Laurent? Uh, you're making me think a little bit. The best present? Um... I don't know. Maybe when I was a kid, uh, my my dad and my mom they ruled out a basketball hoop. So really? yeah, and they put it in the backyard. You know, that was the the best thing for me and my brothers. You know, we would go out there every day and play. And uh, the worst one, probably like uh, some USA polo tank tops. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> now, do you still play a lot of basketball? Uh, I try not to. Really? Yeah, yeah I try not to. Okay. Well, do you, do you play any other sports just outside? I mean, do you have any hobbies other than football that you try to stay active with? Uh, I used to. I mean, no, nah, I just kind of stay off my feet in the offseason. You know, I, I don't want to get too competitive in basketball or twist an ankle or anything, so I try to stay away from it. That's a good point. Now, Tony, best and worst present? I think my best present was uh, I got a nice huffy bike when I was about, about 10 years old that uh -huh. I got some good mileage out of. That was pretty cool. And I think the worst one I got was just any random sweater that my mom gave me that I never <laughs> wore, except for on picture day. But, you know, I, hate, I hated those things. You know, you, you get excited to open up presents, and then you see that. You, it's, not, it's not the best thing. Most definitely. Well, I guess it's time to turn the tables. Um, I know last segment we had Laurent interview Tony. Now, Tony, are you up for asking Laurent a few questions? Sure, sure. Good deal. Well, I guess I'll toss the ball off to you. All right. The first question I have, uh, this is kind of... I'm asking Laurent this, but this is for the fans. They, the, the fans really get to see the end product on, uh, on Sunday. But uh, just take us through a week in the NFL, just getting ready for, for Sunday, Sunday game. All right. So say, say we play on a Sunday. You know, usually you follow in the game, you get that day off. No, you don't get that day off. You get to go in and work out that day. You got to go in and work out, watch the film, make the corrections, do a light jog, you know, get the – just get your muscles moving again after the game. And then Tuesday is our day off in the National Football League, unless, unless you have a different schedule. But Tuesday's the day off. Wednesday, you get to work early in the morning, you know, long days. Wednesday and Thursdays are long days. Wednesday, you go over first and second down um, and you work on that all practice and watch the film the rest of the day. And uh, Thursday is third down day. You know, it's another long day, just like Wednesday. And Friday is a red zone day. so. We, so we really break it down into segments each day, you know, and then, and then Saturday's the walkthrough and you're getting ready for the game and you, either you're taking off in, on a plane or you're going to the hotel. I mean, is that something that you find beneficial to get prepared and focused for a game is being all together? Yeah, I, I definitely think it's beneficial. Uh, I mean, obviously I got two, two little ones and my, my daughter wakes up at night, so it's, it's definitely nice to get a, a good night of sleep and just to clear your head and kind of get away from things. And, you know, be around your teammates, be around your coaches, kind of, you know, make the final checks off the checklist and uh, just get, get your mind right for, for, the, for the next day. Laurent? Uh, yeah, I'm, I was new to it because in college we didn't stay in a hotel unless we had an away game. We, I went to one double-A school, so we would always stay in the dorms, and the dorms was always loud. People were always going out, you know, Friday night. We played on Saturday in college. You know, Friday night the dorms are loud. People are going crazy. So I actually like being in a hotel, you know, so... It's not a lot of noise. You know, you can get in bed early, get a good night's sleep, and wake up and feel refreshed and ready to roll. Uh-huh. Now, so, I get, okay, so this is a question that's kind of an inside deal. But um, as far as rooming with somebody, 
who would you say was probably the, be the worst person to room with the night before a game? Is there anybody <laughs> who's a horrible snorer or just has bad hygiene habits? Who is it? Wow. I'm not going to put anybody out there. <laughs> oh, yeah. Tommy. I'm, I'm not gonna put I mean, we're inside the huddle right now. you got to say, you got to give it something. No, I'm not going to give a name, but, you know, when someone's, when someone's <laughs> snoring and you're not a snorer or you're a light sleeper, it, it's, it's tough. And I've, you know, in training camp, I've had a guy that every day would just – snore and if I didn't go to sleep before him I was going to be up late so oh it's, it's pretty tough oh no so do you get that list I mean when season starts I'm sure that you have you know person x that you're going to be staying with whenever you're rooming the whole entire season right yeah I mean for the most part you're going to stay with you know the same one or two people but uh the one of the first questions I ask is do you snore and <laughs> Because cause I'm a light sleeper. I can't sleep through that. I mean, I'll go as far to get earplugs if I have to. Really? You know, sleep before a game is important. Not a problem. La Laurent? Uh, me, I'm lucky enough that I'm in my fifth year in the league now. I don't have a roommate. So I'm loving it. I, get, I do what I what? want. <laughs> yeah. There you go. I so how it. many years does it take until you get to room by yourself? Uh, I think it's the fifth year. Once really? You fifth year. Wow. I did not know that. It, That's interesting. Sometimes you get lucky. You know, sometimes they make mistakes. And uh, earlier this year, I got a, a room to myself. And uh -huh. uh, when I was in Carolina, I used to get the, my room to myself all the time. All, all the starters, for the most part, get yeah, the rooms yeah, to themselves. That's true, too. Uh, but yeah, it's it's a little different, and it's a little different when you're by yourself. You don't oh. have to worry about so many things. You can just I can chill imagine. Yeah. Just getting that list, and you see that one. It's that guy. You're like, <laughs> man. <laughs> well, good deal. Well, Tony, we wanted to thank you again for coming out. Um, happy holidays and Merry Christmas. Does everybody want to give Tony a round of applause, real quick? To you and your Thanks. family. And uh, Laurent, as always, we'll be seeing you next week. And happy holidays from everyone at um, Inside the Huddle. We want to thank our executive producer, Ray Salinas, our sound engineer, Ted Nichols-Payne, uh, Brandon Myers with uh, Gridiron Films, and, of course, House of Blues for having us each and every Monday night. You are watching Inside the Huddle here on FSN. Yes! <laughs> Inside the Huddle is sponsored by Carter Eye Center, HMS, Papa John's, Westway Ford, Albertsons, Lifestyle Technologies, the Microsurgery Institute, Under Armour, CC Carpet, Pepsi Max, and your local 7-Eleven store. Inside the Huddle is a production of Sports Media. Video production by Gridiron Films.